more than a dozen wallets from the 1950s were found in an old theater in Coffeyville, Kansas. News on 6's Amy Slanchik shares how something old is new again, offering comfort to a woman who recently lost her husband. Coffeyville's Midland Theater is undergoing multi-million dollar renovations right now, and the discovery during construction work took everyone involved a few steps back in time. A discovery of nearly 20 old wallets, presumably left behind in people's seats at the historic Midland Theater. We found old time capsules doing demo in buildings that was kind of interesting, but I've never found anything like this. Construction project manager Steve Barry says he found the wallets inside the old janitor's closet pushed into space above the door. I looked up and saw that red wallet and I had to kind of stretch but it was right here. They just stick them up there and hide them. I don't know why they didn't just trash them but that's okay. That's our, our tracer we found. Steve says there wasn't any money inside, but pictures and handwritten notes that likely haven't been seen in decades. This bank passbook from 1951 was also found. It belonged to Paul Crandell, who died about two years ago. We had our first date in 1952. Now, his wife Irene, who says they would have celebrated 69 years of marriage this year, has a little piece of Paul's past. Well, it's, it's precious to have this. I, I put it in a, our daughter sent a special box that I have his billfold and glasses and all things like that. So that's where I put this. The book captures a moment in Paul's life when he was only making deposits. He was saving money, I'm sure, to uh, get clothes for college or maybe buy a car. And this shows his first three deposits in this book. Across the street from the theater, a mural reads, Our past fuels our future. And this glimpse into who enjoyed the theater in the past is now on the minds of everyone working to restore it. In Coffeyville, Kansas, Amy Slanchik, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.